ask them what they want, and all they say is, the beast inside me. But that ain't been me for a long time. Just like I promised you. Marco gave up Sandman for his daughter. And Craven forced it out of him for a stupid hunt. All right, Marco. What's going on in that head of yours? I tell them to leave us alone, but they don't care. They shoot me with a net, try to hold me down. And I was sand before I knew it. I'm so ashamed, but I had no choice. I gotta get back to you. Marco had to do something, or else he'd be just like Scorpion right now. left me a message. Miles, about the stolen museum pieces. I went to the impound yard and saw an old phone number on that truck you chased down. I may be onto something. Can you come meet your mama for lunch at the park by my office? Chop cheese on me. Any clue is a good clue. If we can't find that truck, the museum will have to close. Plus, I never turn out a chopped cheese. Sure you've heard by now that Mac Gargan, the Scorpion, has been found dead. His stinger removed like a trophy. One can only assume this was at the hands of the Hunters. Are they doing what the ineffectual Spider-Man won't and removing these dangers permanently? Then again, maybe Spider-Man has finally changed his tune. I, for one, say, let them wipe each other out. They're not making our world a better place, and the less of these mass marauders roaming our streets, the better. When they're gone, we can turn the corner back to simpler times. Wouldn't that be refreshing? I yearn for the days of normal news coverage, when I could attack the real issues, like the tanking economy, or the corruption of our youth. Instead of being forced to cover spandexed buffoons who make life for the average Joe a waking nightmare. One day, <laughs> one day. Backpack around here somewhere. All right. Hey, Miles. What's up? Hey, good to see you. I can't believe Mr. Atlas is gonna be here at BV. Maybe one of those scholarships has my name on it. If he likes my sound. New reproductive technologies are on the horizon. Check it out on this brochure. We've got preventative contraception information. 
Please consult your parents and your primary care physician. They'll help you find what's right for you. Yes, those are free. Remember to stay safe. Miles, glad you made it. Oh, hey, Mr. Sinclair. Oh, hmm. I just love seeing all this innovation in action. Oh, have you heard about the chemistry club? They're filling in while Miss Ferguson gets ready to demo the new robotics drone. She's running late. Presentation's on the main stage. Oh, yeah. I'll try to make it over there. Enjoy the show. Thanks. See you around. Hey, Miles, over here. Hey. You made it. I want to talk to him about that computational physics program. We got your missing person report half an hour ago. What happened? That's just it. We don't know. We must get something from her car and then never came back. I just heard two words, missing in person. So I'm gonna say yes. Go ahead. We'll save your seat. Gotta catch up to the principal. Maybe I can find out more. Hey! If it isn't Morales, the music master. What's up, Delisai? You here to see that university rep, Mr. Atlas? Yeah, definitely. Nice astronomy booth. Thanks. You should stop by later. I made a 3D model of Saturn. But get this. <laughs> it's cake! I'll save you a slice. Hmm, thanks. Have any of her personal items? Yes. She left her phone behind. Is it unlocked? Have you seen any texts coming in or anything? Here we go. Just some notifications from her fitness tracker. It's counting her steps, wherever she is. <sighs> the students adore Miss Ferguson. I hope she's all right. Please find her. We'll do our best. Miss Ferguson's missing. Oh, man. Sounds like she's still wearing her fitness tracker. Wonder if I could find that signal. All right. Let's see where this fitness tracker is. Last known location, Dawson Harbor. Beginning text to speech call with Haley Cooper. Miles. Mr. Atlas just got here. ETA? Oh, man. Gotta find Miss Ferguson first. Be there when I can. He's handing out scholarship applications right now. Uh, can you get one for me? I'll do better than that. Send you a link. Thanks. Good luck. And hurry. Hey, yo, Miles. What's up, Genki? Can this wait? Not really. I've got Mr. Atlas here. I told him how you were missing the fair for volunteer work, and he asked for a phone call with you. Is uh, now a good time? Thanks, Genki. Now is definitely not a good time. Here he is, Mr. Atlas. I know you've got a flight to catch. Genki! Hi. Miles? Uh, yeah. Hello. You're whispering. Is now a bad time? Uh, no. I'll make it work. That's me. Great. I heard you're interested in our music technology program. So, tell me about yourself. What do you do for fun? Fun? Uh, well, I used to do music production. But it's been hard to find time lately. Genki here showed me some of your samples. Good stuff. Particularly your song called Swinging. What was your inspiration? Uh, yeah. I was, uh, just swinging one day and... Thinking, uh, the tune just kind of came to me. Interesting. And can you tell me about what's important to you in life? 
Being there for people when they need me. Being reliable, trustworthy. Someone people can depend on. Very interesting. And finally, why do you think you'd make a great addition to our school? I don't give up. And, uh, I care about doing the right thing. And I won't let you down. Fascinating. Well, Miles, thanks for your time. I think I've got enough here. Thanks. Uh, do you want my email so we can stay in touch, or, uh... to BV in time to meet Mr. Atlas in person. Clarify some things. All right. Put those guys out of the way. Let's see where that tracker signal leads. There she is. This glass looks pretty breakable. Anything about the RT X35. It's the same six step lock. Now help us unlock. I got you. Are you okay? I'm fine. But who are these people? How do they know I work for Rand? Let's figure that out when we're not in the hostage situation. You hide. I've got these guys. by yourself it's in my job description ready to go are you going to carry me sure i've carried people as long as i can get verbal confirmation that if i throw up on you you won't sue me uh, consider this confirmation just <sighs> Thanks to Spider-Man, our treasured teacher, Miss Ferguson, is back with us safe and sound. To show our gratitude, it is my honor to declare Spider-Man the official hero of Brooklyn Visions. <laughs> you are always welcome here, Spider-Man. Thank you. And now, back to the Quan. We've got a robotics demonstration to do. Much time. Hi, Miles. I appreciate your dedication to interviewing, but I could tell you were clearly busy with something important. Mr. Sinclair put in an excellent word for you, as did Principal Evans. So let's do this right and meet this week on campus, in person. Got a few app requests popping up on BB's campus. Thought I'd call you directly. Hunters. 
They've been coming through here for days. <clears throat> Sorry I wasn't here to help. Nah. Could you tell me about this antique I found? It, uh, almost killed me. I cannot help you. I've seen this symbol before. Please leave. Wait! I can protect you from the hunters. I'm not worried about them. I thought I left this behind on Volgograd. The flames have been lit. This is his jungle now. Craven? Craven off. The flames have been lit. Huh. Dude! MJ told me you almost died. You okay? Hey, Miles. Actually, never felt better. I should have been... Wait, really? Positive. Hey, let me call you back. Got some bonfires to crash. Uh, okay. Grad? Looks like it's for some kind of party. Wonder what they're celebrating. Pretty rude of Craven not to extend an invite. Never stopped me before, though. This celebration is even more grand than what we Shipping in more luxury goods from Volgograd for this... event? These shipments have to be coming in nearby. 
No airfields here. But what about the docks? Maybe something there can lead me to Craven. Don't make me ask again! I told you! I, I, that's everything! Where is the rest of our ship? Please! That guy needs my help. for some vodka and caviar. Please, Why is Craven doing all this now? It doesn't make any sense. One second he's hunting supervillains and now he's... Entertaining? <laughs> Harry must have done a number on him at the zoo. Better go check on the dock worker. They did a number on him. Easy, easy. You're in pretty bad shape. Let me help you. Uh, hospital. Please. There's one close by. You're gonna be okay. I thought they were going to kill me. What did they want? Some cargo went missing on the journey. Here. They thought I took it. safe. Now, where's the drop-off? 718, Kent. Wonder how Harry's doing without the suit right now. Hey, buddy. How you feeling? I'm fine. What's happening? Craven, or Cravenoff, is hosting some party at 718 Kent. Figured I'd stop by. Looks like a social club. Hang on. I'm almost there. Busy night. Hope our VIP is here. They're more riled up than usual. Just keep your head down and... How are you getting in? Kitchen entrance. You should change. The classic Peter Parker look isn't gonna cut it. Too bad my tux is at the dry cleaners. Biffy. Forget to mention the suit could turn into a tux. Oh, never did that with me. Hey, hey, you, come over here. Take this to Mr. Kravenoff's bodyguard. His bodyguard? Dima, move. Well, sounds like your shift's starting. Yeah, I'll leave you to it. Better go find Dima. Heart is up. How are they eating so fast? Don't keep them waiting. Move. Pretty nice. Yeah. I'm feeling great. 
Nothing stopped them from coming into the kitchen and trying to light me on fire! That was only the one. break your bones. A 300-year-old sleeping dart will never work. You are so certain. Oh, yeah. Show me, then. I'll show him, too. Yes? Take him. <laughs> Let him squirm. The poison is ancient, and you don't even know how to use that thing. A true hunter. Adepts. Sleep well, my friend. Those hunters were nuts. Can't believe the suit listened to me. I wish my suit had a neural interface like this. I could work with Harry, do the hero gig, and take a vacation all at once. That's probably the maitre d' by the podium. Has one of the shield bearers arrived? Uh, yes. He is in the other room by the fire. Will Mr. Cravenoff be joining us this evening? Uh, there are some... Uh... Mm. Quite right. <laughs> Damn. Craven isn't here. Shield bearer. Huh. Sounds like a bodyguard to me. I'll rip him in half with my bare hands. He is not your target. You kill him, you have to do it. Must be him. <clears throat> Your meal, sir. What the hell is this? Um, I was told to deliver this to Mr. Cravenoff's personal bodyguard. What makes you think I am him? <laughs> <laughs> uh, you know, you're uh huge. Dima's very hungry. You should leave now. So funny. I was just about to do that. I was looking up at that room. Gotta find the elevator. If that's just the shield bearer, how big is Dima gonna be? It's too scary. I don't want to serve him food anymore. Just drop the plate and leave. Coming through. Oh, sorry. Don't be sorry. Move! Coming through! Uh, 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 this... Uh, this mess! If everything isn't perfect, we're all dead! Coming through! No! No! No, wait! Uh, 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 why were you standing right in front of the door? I told you to wait! No, you Come didn't! On. I was just minding my... Come on! Shut up, both of you. Pick everything up and let's move. You make a shit waitress, Peter. Or waiter, I should say. Not Find waitress, Wait, waiter. Find Craven and his weird lizard suit. His waitress is a female. Easy. Sorry about that. Secret menu. Someone's a little angry. A tiger. That's new. All right, let's give Dima something to eat that isn't spider flavored. That raw meat must be somewhere. There we are. Something in that study might help me find Craven. But first, gotta break out the apron. That hunter's right there. What the hell was that? 
A meal fit for a Russian tiger bodyguard. That sounded weird. I have to make a few minor adjustments to this meal. Where's that sleeping hunter? A lot of bodies by that sleeping hunter. for Dima, snooping time for Peter. If this doesn't work, there's only one other thing on the menu. Me. Hi, Dima. I'm back with a little snacky snack. Finest work, Peter. Guess Craven's too cool for his own party. That's Should funny. look around in case he left the lizard serum somewhere in here. Don't see Craven's lizard serum here. But what are these potions? Wonder if this is how he's so freakishly strong. He's better read than I would have thought. Nothing like some light philosophy between hunts. Didn't know hunting could be so existential. No serum. These drugs are for late stage chemotherapy. Are these cravens too? Sophia's only a few blocks from here. Craven has to be there with the serum. Time to move. I must have just missed him. Was Craven praying? So Craven has a pet tiger. That tracks. Nice kitty. Dima. It's not what it looks like. I was wondering where that part came in. Exactly how I like to 
one-man army now. Look out! Target acquired. Webs! I could get used to this. Party's getting shut down. Clear shot. How you like me now? Get to the chapel quick. That was fun. Craven yet, but I think I know where he is. How's the suit? Weird. It's like it knows me. Don't worry, buddy. I'll take care of everything. Promise. are back. It's you! I knew that was our meat cute back there! I knew it! I'd love to get to know you better, but I got some business to take care of. Watch out! See, your boss has been up to no good lately. This is my city, not his jungle. He killed Scorpion. Let the lizard loose! And he stabbed me pretty good! Spears like a mini EMP. I'd like a word with him. Especially about that last part. Feel that spider! Zap my gadgets again. Uh, 
about that last part. song and dance. I'm coming, Craven. Here to pick up a serum order for a Dr. Connors? Hunted me. This is good. Let's see if you have the strength to finish what you started. I sense a beast. 
MJ, I got the serum. On my way back to Emily May. How'd it go? Really well. Things just got a little intense with Craven. He's somehow stronger than he looks, if you can believe that. Hey, the important thing is that you're okay. And you got the serum. You did great, buddy. I'll start prepping the gear. How'd it really go? It was totally... I didn't want to worry Harry. Craven knows now that the suit malfunctions when it's within range of certain frequencies. How bad is the malfunction? Not pleasant, but I can handle it. Well, I'm glad you're all right, but watch yourself out there, too. Let me know how things go at the lab. Absolutely. Talk soon. If you weren't a robot, you'd definitely be venomous. Those lines will make it this time Blurry street lights Work as a guide to memories that we're making tonight